All right, we got the sun rising uh, right above the uh, tree line here. We're going with a Chick-fil-A breakfast. So it's breakfast with the endorsement. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. I don't know why I always do that. Uh, it's like very robotic, uh, but it is what it is. Have fork, will travel, Chick-fil-A breakfast, breakfast with the endorsement, quick little video. Uh, I did this product, but in burrito form about two years ago, and it got some decent views, uh, 20,000 views, I believe. Uh, but I think at that time, the burrito wasn't an option on the menu. It might've been a test market. Uh, so I went with this uh, version in the bowl. It is the hash brown scramble bowl. Uh, and I also got a side of their jalapeno uh, salsa right there. Got a little breakfast action. Uh, so here it is. Uh, they asked me if I wanted the sausage or the chicken version. I went with the chicken, Chick-fil-A. I mean, come on, we're not going sausage. So it is basically cheese, hash browns, chicken, and scrambled eggs all in a bowl. The hash brown scramble bowl. All right, very simple, but again, breakfast with the endorsement, uh, Sunday morning, perfect little video. Uh, how's your weekend going? I don't know, just a little laid back video. Uh, not all the uh, hoopla and fanfare, uh, but let's get a little bit of everything on here. This is $3.99. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's worth it. I opened it up and I said, that's a small amount of food, even though it looks like they gave me a decent amount of chicken. Uh, but there it is right there. We got a little bit on the fork. Whoa. I'm a professional, don't try this at home. I'm gonna try it without the salsa. You know, I'm gonna probably need the salsa. Uh, salsa, I just like to say salsa. Shout out Seinfeld, uh, salsa. Because people, people just like, like to, to say, say salsa. salsa. Uh, here we go. Hmm. Yeah. All right, so I enjoyed that first bite. Um, it's everything you would expect it would be from Chick-fil-A, the flavor of the chicken, uh, and then you're getting a breakfast extravaganza. I don't know. They're not reinventing the wheel over here. You got the cheese, hash browns, chicken, and uh, scrambled eggs. I did put the jalapeno salsa, so we're going to give it uh, a taste with that. And then I'll let you go on your way. Enjoy your Sunday. I hope everyone had a great weekend. And I think this salsa is going to kind of pick it up a notch. Uh, I don't want two. I do not want two. That was a rookie move right there. I do not want two uh, hash browns. Got to save those hash browns. It appears looking at this, they gave me more chicken, a decent amount of the uh, scrambled eggs, not enough cheese, not nearly enough cheese, barely any cheese. Am I stressing that enough? But if there's anything in this bowl that you want to have more of, it is the chicken, Chick-fil-A, final bite. Salsa. All right, so if you can see it, uh, the sun is rising. I think it's 8.01, 8.01 in the morning. Uh, and finally, I'm eating something uh, where the Kokomoka latte goes perfectly with it. Um, I like this bowl. I think they skimped on a couple things. I want more cheese in there. Uh, the flavor's okay. It's a nice little bowl, $4 in the morning. Um, they loaded it with chicken, so that was a bonus. Um, and the salsa just kind of put it over the top with a little bit of uh, spice. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna have to give it a rating, uh, but I like it. Did I love it? No. They have the chicken minis. You ever see the chicken minis? Uh, they got those little chicken mini sandwiches. Uh, I almost got those. Uh, but I figured let's try something different, uh, share it with the people and see what you think. So uh, rating time coming up after a Coca Mocha break. This one's kind of settled as I was doing the review. Uh, sometimes you could go to Dunkin'. They do the Dunkin' Stir. I call it the Dunkin' Stir. Or I got to do the Dunkin' Swirl uh, just to get all of the chocolate on the bottom mixed up. Uh, they did not do that for me today. Uh, so a little bit of a Dunkin' fail, but I was able to swirl it up. But uh, all right, we're off track. This is a Chick-fil-A uh, review and the sun is coming up. Uh, so let's get this going. On a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money. And 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the hash brown scramble bowl from Chick-fil-A a rating of 
83. It's fine. It's fine. I like it. Would I ever get it again? Would I get this over the chicken minis? I don't know if I would do that. Uh, I haven't had those minis in a while. Now I am disappointed I did not get the minis. But I still like the bowl. Uh, just didn't love it. So there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing... The sun is just about to peek through. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this little breakfast video uh, to end your weekend. And again, hope you all had a great weekend. I had an okay weekend. I would have had a better weekend if the Yankees could have just won a game. I don't know. Just could have won a game and they would have been in the playoffs. But they probably would have got smoked by the Rays. Uh, it just wasn't their year. Uh, frustrating. Very frustrating. All right. I've talked enough. Uh, have a great Sunday, and we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye.